Good morning, YouTube. Thanks for tuning in to our feature presentation today. Today we are going to get one, possibly two Toyotas, and uh, we're on our way right now to get the first one. This is going to be our friend Wesley's very first part out. He's going in on it with me. What are we getting, buddy? We're getting a 1991 Toyota 4Runner, and um, we're gonna we're gonna swap the parts and stuff. Yeah, he, he needs some parts. So what uh, what parts do you need? Um, probably maybe a radiator because it's it's patched. My radiator's patched. Um, yeah, yeah, it's, it is totally. You definitely gonna... need a back window, yeah. and because mine won't roll down and it won't even open. I've been trying to figure it out for a couple days. I have to crawl on the inside and do it. It's yeah. a pain. Yeah, we were drunk last night, and so I was like, let's fucking do it. So we went in there, got all his tools. We brought a battery. We get that battery out, by the way? Uh, yeah, we did. Okay. Um, and you got the battery for today, right? Right. It's in the truck here? Right. Okay. And we went back there, and I hooked up a battery directly to the uh, window motor. I don't think he needs a, win a window per se, but he needs like the assembly back there because on every first gen 4Runner, which is a similar setup um, that I've ever dealt with, you know, of course the back window never rolls up and down. So I've had to do it, I think three times now. And I eventually just wire in a switch and all that, a double throw, double pull switch. But uh, I went to kind of like diagnose what's going on and I put a battery directly to the motor in both, both polarities to try to get it going up and down, even though it's in the up position. And it, it wants to work, but it just doesn't work. It goes run, run. And then if you do it again, it goes run, run. And then uh, if you do it again, it does the same noise. But basically, it is foobard. So hopefully, we're going to get that off of this truck for Wesley. Um, I'm really excited because. Uh, there's not a whole lot on a 3.0 truck that I can use, but I definitely can use the power steering um, pump, I guess. What would that be? Yeah, it'd be the pump. Power steering pump, because mine is from a 3.4, and I don't have a banjo bolt for it. And uh, somebody from one of my forums that I'm on was extremely, like, went above and beyond. And, and uh, when I was asking for just that banjo bolt from a, what I thought was a 3.0 power steering pump, uh, this dude, like, freaking sent me it didn't charge me a dime for shipping or the part or nothing and uh he was super cool so he sent me the banjo bolt and the part that the banjo bolt threads into which is just another bolt that goes into the body of the, of the thing and uh unfortunately it didn't work it turns out i think i have a 3.4 power steering pump so i would need a 3.4 power steering pump banjo bolt but i don't have that so i'm hoping to just use the 301 from this rig I think you can do that on the 3-4 for my white 4Runner that's getting that swap. Yeah. Now, uh, what's going on with the truck? Why is it so cheap? Um, because it, cause it got wrecked. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's, it got hit by a tree or something. Yeah. It smashed. Um, and it might have a uh, bad head gasket. Yeah, yeah, that's right. The guy said that uh, head gaskets were bad and that it overheats, but... We're gonna find out. If we end up getting the truck, I'm probably gonna, you know, hook a battery to it and see what we get. And uh, we'll go from there. I know the upper radiator hose is dicked. It's like hella ripped, so we'll, we'll replace that with something. I've got, you know, uh, extra radiator hoses, so we'll replace it temporarily with something. Get some fluid running through it and see what we get. We're also looking at, or I'm looking at, a 1975 Toyota Hilux two-wheel drive in like that P swamp ass green that they, that they used to do, which I love. I love that color, that 70s ass color. Um, I may or may not go pick that up later, but we will see on that one uh, for a parts rig for Shihiro so I can get that motor and get it going for Shihiro. doesn't come with a title, so it's definitely a parts truck. You have arrived. Second one. Looks like we may have found our second destination, folks. We're going after that P green 75 Hilux that I was telling you guys about. The Forerunner deal kind of is going up and down. Um, it's good, then it's not good. Guy can, can't find the title, now he can find the title. So we rerouted when he couldn't find the title. We were halfway over here and then he calls me and says he can. So it's gonna be a long day, folks. We are getting two trucks. Yeah, I can fit a lot of Toyotas back here, dude. Right. Sick out here. It's a bunch of cars. Dude, I like this property. This is Me dope. Too. This is super cool. Definitely. We might get killed though, so. Hopefully not. <laughs> it's 
so fast. We should have just stopped and looked at the Yoda. Whoa, whoa. Now we're off roading? Yeah, I don't know. This is not this is seeming not, right. Yeah. Wow, dude, it is warm out here. Oh, yeah. All right, this is the beast. It's already way rougher than I thought. All the seats are slamming, dude. Jeez. Hmm. It is the SR5. Oh, I don't even know if I want it. It's rough. It's got some interesting patina. It's a shame because I do need this window. Hmm. worth 50 bucks or something. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's a bummer. It's got all the rust. It's not through yet, at least on here, but it is on the other side. It's uh, not gonna run, that's for sure. It's got freaking bees in there. It's going on underneath. Oh, man. Well. I'm just trying to think what I could do with it. You know, turn it into another trailer. Yeah. I don't really need another trailer. This piece, I was really hoping was in good condition because on my white truck, my other SR5, this thing's gone. But unfortunately, this has pinholes in it as well. It is in better condition. Hmm. That's a bummer. This piece is of interest for sure, although that crap all over here. Yep. Um, this grill right here doesn't seem to be connected on that lower portion right there. I should remember where this is. Oh, right there. Okay, so actually that would go back. The tab is not broken on it, so that's good. This grill often breaks right here. Yep, you can see it. You can see it kind of chipping right there. It's cracked. So that's a bummer. That emblem's rare. I want that emblem. There it is. That's what I needed to see right there. That's no good. Frick, dude. That thing's gnarly. Look at all that caked on grease. Oh, yeah. No, oh, man, I don't think I want this truck. Yeah. Let's go get that other truck. This thing's been so abused, sitting in the sun. Look how, look how much that would shine up, though. Oh, yeah. Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. That's the color it's supposed to be. Now, I'll wait for a cleaner one. This thing's hammered. Good that. Yep. I do need that window really badly, though. The exact canopy I have. Hmm. Never seen one before. It was on. It's on another SR5. It's this window right here. All right, let's go. Well, like you guys have seen before, sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. It was worth coming and checking out. It was only like 40 minutes away from where we were. Where we were. Um, but that's fine because that means that we can go back now and get oh, crap all over me, huh? Mm -hmm. I can. Uh, we can go back and get the thing. Oh, that might be him calling me right there. Okay, we are at our last destina destination of the day. We are going to go for that Forerunner. Is this it? Yep. Twice. You have arrived. Yep, 26800. Yep. yep. All right. And uh, I'm not sure if anyone's there because it just keeps going back and forth. Okay, we're good. We found the title. Okay, we don't have the title. Okay, we found the title. Come on over. Okay, I'll be there at this time. Okay, we're five minutes away. And this dude's like, yeah, so like no one's answering. He's No one's there. I'm not sure if... Uh, not sure if anyone's gonna even can be here, so um, I'm just gonna park right here, I That's think, what I was thinking. and then figure it out from there. Cause crazy man, looks like that's our forerunner right there. The S10 in front of it. Yep. 
I don't know if you guys have a trailer. Or... Yeah, I have a flatbed up there. Okay, I don't know if you want to pull down here. Or... Yeah, if we if we end up getting it, which is likely, I will do that. Um, looks like okay, yeah, that's, that that thing drives. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's good. I'm, I'm a dog guy. Yep. It's all good. What's his name? Fruit Loop. No, Lulu. Lulu. You're kind of a Fruit Loop, though, huh? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. I know. Okay. All right. Yeah, you're a good dog. Lulu, come here. Come you're here. a good dog. So, what's the story on it? I'm not too sure. It's actually my buddy's car. Uh, I think he said it was running and driving. Yeah. He said something about overheating or something. Yeah, he didn't really even want to get rid of it, but he just needed the cash. Okay. Um, yeah, we pulled the radiator earlier. He said that there's a aluminum radiator that comes with it. Um, shit, I don't know about that. Really? Uh, the one we pulled, he might be talking about. Well, he said he was pulling the radiator, but I said, "Oh, dang it, I wanted the radiator." And he said, "Well, I could throw in the aluminum one." Um, I can go ask his wife. That that'd be cool. Yeah. Huh? I'm not I'm not making it up. I promise. Yeah, for sure. We're gonna kind of crawl through it and look, okay? Yeah, These windows are sick, dude. These are factory tent, I think. I could be wrong, but I think they're factory tent. Oof. Ooh, really bad. Thanks. Maybe I don't want the seats. I do want that shift shifter bezel, though. It's all brown. Yeah. Hey, that works. Ooh, nice. You know, get rid of this. I think it's yeah. just a tape on deal. Got the key. That's good. It's not too bad. It's pretty decent. Besides the piss smell. <laughs> yeah, besides the piss smell. It's got automatic hubs, or yeah, it's auto hubs. Let's see if this opens. I don't even know. I'll probably pull this. Hang on, hang on. Let me open this first. It's not going to open without a battery, dude. Oh, yeah. So you got to roll right. the window down. Right, right. Well, I want to see if this thing works. I might take this. Yeah. That'd be rad. I thought about having one doesn't. Yeah. All right, but you know that that's a cool thing. I'm good. You don't like that? I don't like spoilers. Oh. What do you think? Hmm. It's alright. I like it. I'm taking the seats. Okay. Even though they're piss ridden, but I'm gonna clean them and steam them and clean them and steam them again. So I guess that's it, folks. We'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching, um, liking, subscribing, all the YouTube stuff that people do. Um, I'm going to go melt now. So see you later. Thanks for watching.